Hi. Thanks for clicking on my channel. So the reason why I'm wearing this hat is because one, we totally did not have our Cinco de Mayo celebration. I'm sad. No, I'm joking. Um, and another reason, my hair is wet. I can't really work with it right now. It's crazy. But thankfully, I picked up something new. Hopefully this maybe would help. <laughs> uh, purely inspired Vitality Series. Collagen peptides. Okay, so I've done a review on collagen peptides before. This one's different, obviously. Um, it had some things that caught my eye, like it actually has biotin in it, has um, 18 grams of protein as well. Let me look at the ingredients. Um, protein, biotin, calcium, and sodium are the first few uh, ingredients on the list. And sodium is less than 1%, so that's good. It has a thousand uh, percent of uh, biotin. Good thing I'm not a makeup channel. Look at this. <laughs> I have been out in the sun a little bit. Anyway, so this is a first time reaction review. Um, the only thing I've done so far is taken off the little seal thing. Uh, so it's easy to open. Other than that, I haven't opened it yet. I, ha I did fork it a little bit to help me open it. Very easy. And it has settled a little bit. It's white cream color. Um, it says you can put it in smoothies. Uh, oatmeal, coffee, what have you. I usually put it in coffee if I have it in the morning. So this is the serving size. It's 70 calories per scoop, and you only need one scoop for this one. So that is nice. I'm going to put it in my cup. I'm using a clear glass because um, you guys can see, and I can see how well or not well it mixes. So here is the product in, um, let me turn that because I don't want to promote that. <laughs> um, here is the product. I'm stirring it in about eight ounces of water. So this one is flavorless, but I wanted to put it in, it's okay, it's clumping a bit. It smells, it smells like a barn. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, it did say grass fed. I don't know. Did it come straight from the barn? Okay, I'm not sure if I can actually drink this. It smells like hot swamp water from a barn. <laughs> oh god, that really smells bad. Uh, okay. Um, you know, I'm not sure. It does. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look the best. I should have put it in coffee so I didn't see this, and it maybe would have overpowered the smell because I do like dark coffee. So uh, maybe when I add it to coffee, it'll overpower the. The smell and oh god that really smells bad i'm gonna take one for the team oh my gosh do not do not drink that oh my gosh horrible so yeah i would definitely prefer adding it to something but um what what will what will cover that nasty smell i do not know holy cow i don't know if i can actually i'm gonna try um, to mess around with it, you know, add some different ingredients, add the smoothies, and see how, I hope I don't waste a whole lot of groceries, because, you know, oh my gosh, so, um, the taste, no, <laughs> basically, to make it short, it's just not a really good taste, it did say unflavored, but it just has a smell, like it's from a barn, I mean, it does say it's grass-fed, so I don't know if they picked it up straight from the barn, and Whatever, um, there's biotin in it, it's grass-fed pasture-raised, uh, 20 collagen peptides, um, it has all these little things down here, no BGH, I'm not sure what that is, I'll look into that, non-GMO, gluten-free, no sugar added, and keto certified, and also paleo certified, but wow, I don't know if I can stomach this product, um, I definitely will uh, update when I'm finished, I'm going to try to choke it down. The best I can try to cover up the best I can um ew <laughs> basically so yeah it was about $22 at Walmart um and you know I don't think I'm gonna repurchase this unless I can really find some good recipes to cover the smell and the the um the taste oh I mean wow so that's my review for today. I hope you guys have a great day. And let me know if you try this, if you have any recipes that will combat the nasty smell and, and uh, the displeasing taste. That would be great. Have a great day, guys.